So today is World Cancer Day. Now, I don't know if anyone um, knew that, but I've tried to publicize it as much as I can. Not because I wanna bring um, light upon my situation, but I wanna bring light on other people's situations as well. Um, I've been accused of trying to make money off this. I'd like to point everyone out to the point of I don't make any money off this. I haven't monetized anything. I haven't asked anyone for money for anything. I put stuff in the papers, which is in the papers today and in the press, uh, just to gain more exposure and awareness for everything for everyone. For me, I've not taken a penny. I don't want people's money. I'm here in Gloucester today uh, because I went and saw my family. Yeah, thank you everyone for your support, love, care and well wishes. So how do we know who's good for us as people who are suffering with cancer and how do we know who's good for um, our journeys? How do we know that charities we give money to um, actually spend that money well? How do we know what they're spending it on? How do we see this transparency? How do we know who's stopping and barring things that work in other countries? How do we find out how this information is actually spread around and how do we find out who is to blame? And at the end of the day, if something is mis misleading and if something is not true, who do we hold accountable for that? How many people who have got cancer die from bad information? How many people with cancer die because they're given the wrong information? And how many people with cancer are given the wrong information by people that they think they should trust? And how many people do they think they can trust are, who are just huge, huge, huge charities, huge companies and huge NHS based trusts and things like that. They trust these people to cure them or save them or make them better. And at the end of the day, sometimes the things that are advised actually do not work. And some of the things that people advise other people on the internet are just a crock of like just a load of rubbish. For me, we need to debunk this over the next month or two. How can we debunk this? We can go and find those people. We can hold them accountable to everything. And do you know what's fun about this? I don't get paid for anything. So whatever I do, I don't have anything anyway. So whatever I do, I can just be one person. And if someone wants to try and sue me for something, go ahead, I've got nothing. I don't care, right? So at the end of the day, go for it. But me, I'm not an activist. I'm not someone who just goes around and will just be left in the dark about everything. I want to help everyone that I can. And awareness is about helping people and awareness is about helping people who really deserve it. Now, if you wanna, wanna continue to watch, feel free. I'm gonna go to some awesome places. I'm in Gloucester, obviously, right now and beautiful place here but I really want to hold people accountable to things and today I was in the press I was in papers I was in everything I've got a two-page spread in the paper I'm front page news and for me that's awesome no one's paid me for that I've done it and I've made videos for them I've helped them with everything they can because I want exposure and I, I'm, I'm glad I've done it I want to help people None of this is a bullshit thing for me to try and help myself. I'd love to find answers for myself, but now it's gone beyond that. I've promised things and said things that I'll do and I, I will do them. I can expose something that's wrong in the system or there's something that can help people in this country, but then it's not accessible. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to do as much as I can to expose that and show that. That's how it is. That's what it is. That doesn't make me an activist. That makes me a person who wants to help. Thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Uh, the subscription thing should be around here somewhere um, and feel free to watch as many videos as you like. If you'd like to find out more about me uh, go to peewetoms.com and there's loads of info about me and everything that's going on.